Hey guys, happy Thursday. Is it Thursday? Thursday. Happy Thursday. Uh, nice to see you. Um, today, oh, I had a really good day yesterday. A really good day. Uh, if you watch yesterday's video, I was talking about how I was really kind of digging into the mechanics of my story. And, um, and sometimes when you do that, sometimes it's really hard, and sometimes it just kind of works, and it gives you heaps of energy. And so I had a really good day. I wrote all day yesterday. I didn't end up doing any drawing at all, so I need to do that today. Uh, but, um, but the writing just really kind of fired, so that was great, and I'm really happy with what I've got, and I've sent it back now to my, uh, to my publisher and my editor, uh, and they will tell me what they think, and they'll send me some more notes, and, and we'll go from there. Um, but hey, uh, do you like my t-shirt? Mm -hmm. I got this for Christmas. Um, when you're stuck at home, like many people are at the moment, um, you can wear clothes that you probably wouldn't wear outside. Hmm. So, um, being stuck at home is a really great time to read. And obviously, I think reading's awesome, um, because that's what I do. Uh, so I thought I would read one of my books to you, uh, just in this video today. Um, I'd give you a, I'd give you a book. So, uh, I'm going to read P and Nut. P and Nut, this is one of, uh, my picture books, uh, that I made. And I've actually just finished the second one, P and Nut Go for Gold, uh, which will be coming out, uh, in Australia and New Zealand, um, uh, in a little while, a little bit later in the year. Um, so, uh, I thought I might read you this. Okay, let's try Pea and Nut by me. This is Pea. She likes her own space. And this is Nut, all up in her face. What you doing? You busy? You look like you're baking. I could do better than whatever you're making. How about a cake battle? I know that I'd win. They'd put mine on display and yours in the bin. Now P might look calm. He might be mellow, but she's not about to lose to this boastful fellow. In go the eggs. One, two, three, six. Take out the shell and give it a mix. A good helping of flour. Throw in a bit more. Tip, tip, tip. Oops. Now it's all on the floor. The cakes go in the oven. And then comes the waiting. Nut finds the waiting extremely frustrating. I'm taking mine out. P is happy to wait. But it could also be fun to mess with her mate. If you really want to win, don't think too small. Prize-winning cakes are always tall. And so Nut begins a complex production of layers and towers and major construction. He balances here and he cuts over there, building his cake high into the air. Is that it? asks P. Now don't be half-hearted. Oh shush you, says Nut. I'm just getting started. Bet you can't climb it. The oven goes bing. Nut sings from the top. 
I'm the cake making king. But P knew something, not forgot in the rush. When a cake's half cooked, the middle's just mush. Nut's cake tilts and trembles, squelches and slides. He loses his balance as it splits and divides. The crazy cake topples under poor Nut. Splat! Goes his cake. And... Thud! Goes his butt. Here is Nut, whose cake was a dud. And here is P, with a slice for her butt. The end. That's it, guys. I better get to work. Uh, have a great day doing whatever you're doing, if you're in class, uh, if you're at home, uh, whatever's going on. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Bye.